Paul Keating once said, when you change the government, you change the country. Well, I've just finished a Labor's first sitting fortnight in government. And at a time when inflation, that's the cost of living, is up 6.1%, when interest rates have gone up to 1.85%, the cost of living pressures on Australians, what's the new government focused on? You've got the Senate President saying she wants to get rid of the Lord's Prayer. You've got the House of Representatives passing a bill to introduce euthanasia laws into the Northern Territory uh, and into the ACT. Um, as the Shadow Minister for Indigenous Australians, you hear a lot about the, what the, how the government cares about Indigenous Australians, but what did they do this week? They made their lives harder by getting rid of the cashless debit card, uh, which is designed to reduce alcohol consumption, reducing violence in communities around Australia. And as Shadow Attorney General, the government's first big reform was to publicly advertise roles in the Human Rights Commission and to intervene in two cases that were before the court that affected the migration law and the national security of Australians. And it's interesting that Labor likes to talk about integrity because all the while they were getting rid of the ABCC, the Building and Construction Commission, they were reducing the amount of opportunities for people to debate, reducing the number of uh, questions that we in the opposition can ask, uh, and almost all, on all occasions the independents voted with the Labor Party. Our job as the opposition is to keep the government to account. Um, and that's what we're, we're doing in a whole range of areas and I'll keep doing while fighting for our wonderful community of Barrow.